In this video, we are going to compare two distributions by using a box plot. The data comes from the early fall 2009 class survey, and the variable that we're using is speed, which comes from the question, what's the fastest you've driven a car within the last 12 months? If we look at our box plots, we see we have a box plot for females and a box plot for males. So we're going to compare the speeds of males and females. So our first step is to go to the horizontal axis and label our numbers so we can help estimate values from the box plot. And between 50 and 175 and between 100 and 150 is 125 and in between 100 and 50 and 200 is 175. So we we'll begin with the males. There's no outliers to the left, so this is the minimum value. Minimum value looks like 70. So this value of 70 is not exact because any time that we read from a box plot, these are just going to be estimations. So the minimum equals 70. We call this Q1, first quartile and that looks about 80. This is the second quartile, the median, and the median looks like about 85. This is Q3, the third quartile, it looks like about 95. We have our upper fence. Anything beyond this value is going to be considered an outlier. Looks like we have one, two, three, four, five to the right. This fence looks like about 120. So anything beyond 120 is going to be considered an outlier. This value here looks like about 130. These two values here look like about 135. This one is 150 and our maximum value is 200. So the five number summary would be 70, 80, 85, 95, and the maximum is 200. Let's look at the females. We have three outliers to the left, but no outliers to the right. So it looks like the lower fence would be about 60, this outlier looks like about 55, this looks like about 45, and then the minimum looks like around 40. Q1 looks like it's about the same as Q1 for the males, 80. The median looks like about 82, maybe 83. Q3 looks like about the same as the median for males, 85. And then the maximum value looks like about 100. So the five number summary for females would be a minimum value of 40, Q1 at 80, the median Q2 82, Q3 85, then the maximum 100. We're going to use these values to answer the following questions. Now to answer these questions we'll begin with the first one, compare the centers of these distributions. Okay, As we learned in previous videos, uh, the measures of central tendency can be the mean, median, or mode. The only one that we can determine from a box plot is the median. So we say the median for males was 85 miles per hour. The median for females 
was a little bit less was about 82 miles per hour. So the male's center is a little bit larger than the female's center. For the spread, how the numbers are spread out, there are two that we can determine from the box plot. We can talk about the IQR, which is Q3 minus Q1. The IQR for males is 15 miles per hour and this is coming from Q3 95 minus Q1 80 and that gives us 15 miles an hour. IQR for females is about 5 miles per hour and that's coming from Q3 85 minus Q1 80. Now we can also talk about the range using the box plot for the spread. The range is the largest minus the smallest. The range for males would be the largest minus the smallest which is 130 miles per hour. Again this is for males. And for females, it would be 100 minus 40 to be 60 miles per hour. And that's for the females. So in both the IQR and the range, there's more spread to the male distribution than the female distribution. Next question, we compare the shapes of the distribution. For the females, this is our left tail and this is the right tail. So this sort of indicates that we have a longer left tail. So we would say this is skewed left. If we look at the males, here's the left tail. There's the longer right tail. We would say this is skewed right. So for number three, the shape the distribution of males skewed right. The shape of the distribution of females is skewed left. The last one, are there any outliers? For males, we had some to the right. There was an outlier at 130. There were two outliers at 135 and then we had another one at 150 and then we had the last one at 200 so there were four outliers no I'm sorry one two three four five outliers to the right for the females we had three at the left 55 45 and 40 so to summarize so according to these box plots, males center is larger. Males have more spread, both by the IQR and the range. The shape, females skewed left, males skewed right. And we had outliers to the left for the females, outliers to the right for the males. Thanks for watching.